guys, welcome back. So, today I wanted to show you guys how to create a perfect base for your makeup. A foundation, blush, everything except for your eyes. A lot of times when I work with a makeup artist and I love what they do, sometimes it's really overwhelming for me to be like, whoa, how do I create this whole look? So what I've learned to do is ask them, well, how do I get that like amazing coverage that you did? And I find it much less overwhelming than when somebody just throws a makeup look at you that's like an entire thing and it just seems very overwhelming and hard to do, at least for me. My goal today is to just like simplify your life and show you guys step-by-step -step basics. So for today, it's just about the base. This is not for everyday makeup unless you're someone who likes a lot of coverage. I happen to be someone who likes a lot of coverage for my daily life. but. It is time consuming. So if you're looking to learn how to create a really flawless kind of photoshopped finish on your face, if you have a, an event coming up or a photo shoot, then this is the video for you. So um, let's just get started. So to start off, you wanna prime your skin. But right now I'm obsessed with this CC cream by Supergoop, just for my everyday. It's got really even coverage. And using a, a damp beauty blender, I'm just gonna put it all over. So that's just the CC cream. You're gonna see me using the Skindinavia makeup setting spray a lot throughout the, the process. And I do find that it helps set everything. It also helps your makeup last way longer. Then for foundation, I'm using Cover FX. I'm gonna mix these two colors together. It's G40 and N40. So I'm gonna take these two colors together, mix it all up, and then I'm gonna start layering it. And this takes a little more time that's why it's not like your everyday makeup, because you really want a lot of coverage and you want it to look, you don't want it to look cakey. The key is to go really slow and just layer it in thin layers. So always, whenever you're doing your makeup, don't forget to bring it down to your neck. So now that I've laid my base down, I'm gonna give it another round. Oh, the spray feels so good too. Next, I'm gonna use concealer. This is NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Custard. And so I'm just gonna put it in the areas that I feel I want a little extra coverage. Then for under my eyes, I'm gonna use, you can use the NARS Creamy Concealer too if you want, but I'm gonna use Tarte Shape Tape just cause I want it to be a little bit brighter for under my eyes. Okay, under eyes are done. So I'm gonna start with uh, some cream blush. This is Glossier's Cloud Paint. Beam and Dusk. I'm gonna mix them together. You wanna keep your blush up on your like high cheekbones because that's gonna kind of give you that lift instead of here, which is kind of gonna draw everything down. So I, I put a little bit and then I blend it with the blend with the beauty blender. And again, like this takes a little bit of time because you're you're not you're you're going very light so that it's nice and layered. Then for a highlight, I'm gonna use this Honest Beauty palette and I'm just gonna take my finger and apply it. I'm gonna add bronzer, the bronzer from this Charlotte Tilbury Insta Look in a Palette. Just to give everything a little bit of dimension. Isn't this fun? Then I'm going to go in with the blush, it's called Cheek, and I'm gonna set the cream with powder. And then using the highlight that comes in the palette, I'm just gonna go over the cream. Then I'm gonna set everything with Laura Mercier's Universal Setting Powder. And then I'm gonna set everything one more time. My eyes were already done pre this video, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a little lip. This is Charlotte Tilbury's Pillow Talk Lip Cheat Liner. And then I'm gonna go over that with Wander Beauty's Barely There. I love this color, it just goes with every look. This is the Lip Setter Dual Ended Lip Liner from Wander Beauty as well. Okay, this is it. This is your base. Does it look good? Okay. So this is it. This is your photo ready event wedding, red carpet, whatever you're going to look, selfie. I think it's easy, let me know. Would you guys do this? Um, did it seem pretty simple? And that's like the goal of what I'm trying to do is just help simplify your lives but then make you look like 
you just got your makeup done or like you are a professional makeup artist. So if you like the video, let me know, comment, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to madisoncharles.com, my blog, and follow me on Instagram at Kelly L. Kruger. And please, please press that subscribe button. I want more subscribers to this channel so that I keep making videos. That sounds desperate, we're not gonna use that. <laughs> Just hit the subscribe button, <laughs> hit the like button, and um, I'll see you guys next Monday. Bye!